This is Makeup Mermaid 22 with another video, and this video is going to be about my new mermaid hair. So if you might have noticed, something's different. I have long, luscious hair in a very bright aerial red color. Um, so I wanted to get a wig. This is from Arda Wig. It's the Arda Wigs. It's the Apple Red Ferrari, and um, I think it costs thirty-five dollars. It's in the medium wig section. And um, it's very wavy and curly, and it's got some nice bangs, which Ariel has some really big bangs, so I like that. Um, it's pretty nice. This is kind of be kind of be like a review and haul. Wanting to get a um, bright red Ariel kind of wig for a while, and I've been interested in wigs because if you haven't noticed, I have very short hair, and it would take a long time to grow it out long if I wanted to do it red. I was thinking about doing it red because I've always wanted bright red hair, but um, I didn't want it to look like Ronald McDonald or anything like that, so I decided to get a wig. Um, the wig was $35, and then I also bought a wig cap, which was $2. I got a um, mannequin head, which was $5. And I got a few other things from Arda Wigs. Um, it came in this hairnet type thing, if you are wondering, so to keep it very untangled and nice. Um, and with that, I also bought these little wig clips, which go on the inside of the cap. It comes with some, but they're plastic, so I don't know how long they'll last. So I got these for a few dollars. I think they're actually 99 cents. So that's pretty good. Um, and I got a few color strip samples. These are 25 cents each, and I thought I'd get a few just in case I wanted to order any more wigs from Arda, so I'd be able to see what they actually look like. Because they have some of the um, wigs in like in some of the colors, but they don't have pictures for all the colors, and it might not be the same, like a different not natural lighting. So um, I got four shades. Um, I got this one is mint, which I've been wanting mint hair, but it's very hard to achieve that on natural hair without it looking just like blonde hair that's been chlorine damaged or something like that. So um, I got mint, and I'm thinking about getting this. This mint, it's got like a ton of different shades in it. It's very pretty. I don't know how well it'll pick up on the camera, but it's got a bunch of different shades in it. So that's nice, because um, it looks more like natural hair, because natural hair usually isn't all one color. Um, I got this color, which is um, like dusty blue which I was thinking about getting a wig in this color, but I decided not to, and I'm glad I did it, because it kind of looks more brownish, drab blue, when I do see it. So I'm glad I didn't get this. Um, I got this bright electric blue, which that's a really fun blue color. And I also got this lilac, which is a bit darker than it was looked online. It's more like a mid-purple, but I really like it. It's like a, an electric light purple. Okay. So yeah, I'm thinking of getting... Um, a short curly wig. I think it's in Jane in this color. Okay, so first impressions. Um, I think it does look very nice on. The bangs help hide your natural hairline since my natural hairline is not really red. Um, but And I like it. I'll show you the back. There's the back. I like to pull most of the hair to the front because it doesn't really matter that there isn't much in back and it looks more like luscious and better if you have it pulled to the front and um, yeah I, I like it um, when you first put it on it's a little bit itchy and like annoying to wear and you have to fiddle with it a lot to get the hairstyle you want but it's a lot nicer than the wig um, I got that is from um, like Party City or something like that which is just a tangly mess. Here it is. It like even in the package, it looks really fake and bad. This one, it looks and feels a little bit nicer than this, and this one sheds a lot. So, I would, if you're going to get a wig, I would opt to get a little bit more expensive. Arda wigs run from thirty to for the lace front wigs, like around seventy five dollars, I think. Um, so they're pretty. I mean, affordable if you are going to splurge, but. You might not get something for $15 more that you might be able to use more than once, you know. Um, it arrived relatively quickly. Um, I ordered it on a Friday and it got delivered, I think, on around the next Thursday because they do not do any shipping, like, send anything out over the weekend. So they sent it out around Monday, so 
it arrived pretty quickly, and um, it came in a nice box. That was mainly because the wig head took up so much room. But shipping was around seven dollars, so um, kind of moderately pri priced. If you are gonna order a wig, get a few so you don't have to repay the shipping. Um, and I enjoy it. It's very pretty. You can style it. These are made of, um, I think they're Hyperlon or something like that. They're nicer quality than the costume store wigs, so you can heat style them and um, kind of recurl it if you wash it, which you should do every once in a while. Um, so I'm going to probably use this to do like aerial inspired outfits of the day or just to wear it for fun. Inside it's got clips so you can pull it tighter or looser, which also doesn't happen on the costume store wigs. Um, so you can really fit it to your head, and then I don't have it pinned on my hair right, head right now, so it's staying put, even though I don't have it really pinned down with bobby pins or anything like that. It, move, it shifts a little bit, and I bet if I turn my head upside down it might move. But um, So you can get that the wig about the size of your head, and then you can bobby pin it if you know you're going to be moving around a lot. So I got it for Disney outfits of the day, maybe doing like an aerial cosplay or something like that, and just to have fun red hair. You can add bows, you can heat style it on a low setting because it is made of a nicer um, fiber, so you can straighten it or curl it. Um, you can, here's my little aerial bow I just got from Hot Topic, you can put a little bow in there. And they have it very, be very cute and fun and girly. They have a variety of wigs on Arda, um, from long to short to frizzy to like afro to straight to like, they have a big variety, a lot of colors. Sometimes they're sold out, but if you wait long enough, you might be able to get them. Um, yeah, so I like Arda and I like this wig and I'll get back to you on how well it lasts. Ask my questions and get some answers. What's a fire and why does it, what's the word, burn? When's it my turn? Wouldn't I love, love to explore that shore up above? To part of your world, um, sing, singing cover and other fun makeup tutorials and stuff in the future. Thanks for watching.